Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 15 in Candy Crush Saga's special event, Winter Festival. There we go. We have a new feature on this board. We've got a lot of new features for several folks who are playing this special event because you can get this event if you're in the 7,000 level range or in the 100 level range. And so if I am not very clear at explaining what these features are, or if you have questions, please ask, and I'll do my best to either explain them or point them to tutorials that can help you. This one is called the Candy Cane Curl. And you have to match candies next to the candy cane curls to remove its layers. But we also have candy cane fences, and we just can't move these. These are just permanently here, and we have to get through them by uh, bringing this through because it's on a uh, portal system or by using specials to get to that. So what have I got to do? In 20 moves, I've got to reach 140,000 points. And one of the best ways I know to do that is to make specials. Uh, since they've changed the point structure, one of the best ways to get points, oops, hello, meant to do that on a board like this, is to get not only a color bomb, but a color bomb wrapped candy combo. If I can get that, I think I'll get a lot of points. Also, taking out things that are in the way, that's a good idea. I've got this opportunity to do wrapped wrapped combos. I think I'm going to do it. It's only going to reach over here, so it's not going to hit this and blow everything up. But this is probably going to blow this up eventually anyway. So let's do this and see what kind of a... Hello. What kind of a burst it gives us. That's not bad. This did get struck, and now it is blowing up the color bomb. But that's okay, because when we take out a color, it concentrates things down and gives us a better shot at something like that. So there are lots of different ways to make points here. But... I do know that uh, a color bomb wrapped candy combo seems to be golden on these boards. I can do another wrapped wrapped, and that's not awful, but I think I'm going to keep going for the color bomb wrapped. And then, of course, if I've got a lot of orange on the board, that's going to help instead of just having a little. So I'm going to try to bring just a bit more orange on the board. I thought taking out some waffles would help with that. It didn't, and I don't want to lose this opportunity. So let's see if that gives me the, the blast that I thought it would. Look at that. That's pretty nice. That's growing. I'm still only at half of where I need to be. Well, it's just going to keep growing, so I'm just going to be quiet and watch it go. That's the boost we need. That's the thing you need to be looking for if you can manage it. I'm trying to figure out how can I bring this purple down. I would normally just match the blue, but that would take out all of the blue. Well, let's do this. We've been experimenting. We've seen what a color bomb wrapped candy could do. So should I do this? No, I shouldn't. And the reason is I don't have a lot of orange on the board. I do have a lot of purple on the board. Whoops, well, that all happened, but that's okay. Again, we're taking out a color, so we're concentrating things down. Now there's not as much purple. So now maybe I can get another color bomb. And I don't have a whole lot of blue on the board, but I have enough at least to experiment. I could do another color bomb, and that wouldn't be bad. I could do another wrapped wrapped, and it would be okay. But I want to experiment and see what happens and how much I can get by doing that. That's a good combo, too. Almost enough to get us there. Come on, keep going. There we go. And yay, got it. Okay, so now I can breathe a little more easily. So definitely combos are the way to go here. Now I just have to burn off these two moves. Some of you um, are used to playing and noticing that as soon as you achieve your goal, the game ends. That's not so in these play-to-win type levels so these special events uh, so you either win or you lose and you don't get stars you just you know it's a pass or fail type situation now here's the wonderful thing we are at level 15 and every multiple of five we get a special reward plus i've been saving up my hot chocolate 
Not intentionally, I just kept forgetting to use it. So here we go. Ooh, we get a UFO. That's great, as it says. However, people have been reporting that, at least on some devices, the UFOs have been rather stupid these days. So uh, sorry to say that... Um, the UFOs don't seem as valuable to some folks as they used to be. All right, so let's go ahead and convert a few things. I've got eight cups of hot chocolate. I'm going to go ahead and decorate the fountain here. Wonderful. We get a chocolate fountain, and I have enough even to decorate this red kiosk here as a counterpart to the green kiosk. And we're getting very close. I have to clear these out now. These are each going to take a little bit more, six mugs each, in order to get these done. And so I've got a few more levels ahead of me before I can get this first leg of the journey done. If this was helpful, I would ask that you consider liking and subscribing. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below, especially if you know what reality level this uh, level in the Winter Wonderland, Winter Festival, corresponds to. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.